I don't think anyone is willing to touch the idea of limiting population growth. And you know, I've, I've, I've had letters back from politicians when I point out the problems that are due to population. Well, they said the Constitution, you know, we can't limit the people that come to Colorado. And, and uh, in one sense, that's true in the constitutional sense. But that means if you accept that, we're doomed to destruction. Now, a thing that's happening is it isn't just that people want to come here. It's people are invited here. And you know how the cities compete with one another to give big tax breaks to companies if they'll only come here and, and build a big factory. And you have many millions of dollars a year spent privately and publicly advertising your state, and it's probably true in all 50 states, to try to get companies and industries to move in and create jobs. And I like to point out to politicians that, did you know that creating jobs in a community increases the number of people in the community who are out of work? And no, they didn't know that. I said, well, here's the way it works. Now, you tell me if this is wrong. Suppose you had 5% unemployment across the country, and here's a community that gets a new factory. So what happens? Well, the unemployment rate dips from 5% to 3%. And then what happens? Well, people move into the community to restore the 5% unemployment rate. But now it's 5% of a bigger population. So you can say right off the bat, create 100 jobs in your community and you probably increase the number of unemployed people in your community by five or six every, you know, it's like 5%. There's a big transient population of families that move around to where the jobs are. I mean, the word gets out. And, uh, you know, if, if creating jobs lowered the unemployment rate, then we in the front range in Colorado would have a negative unemployment rate. We've created thousands of jobs here in the past several decades, maybe million, maybe a million jobs in the past several decades. It hasn't lowered the unemployment rate. It's always the same. The politicians seem to think that's what people want, and it's very attractive. They don't think about the, the, what's really happening with job creation. They think, oh, well, gee, if we get more jobs, then, then we'll have fewer unemployed people, and that just isn't true. You, you, and, and I think people, I think politicians somehow are congenitally oriented toward, toward saying things like this. We've got to get more people here and have more jobs.